We're here with goalkeeper Shane Gore after our fantastic 1-0 win at home to Leiston. Shane, first of all, the team's performance. Superb. Really good. Um, obviously, we've been building some momentum in the last few weeks and the way we are controlling games, the passing, everyone knows the job, they're getting back into shape. And we deserved it. All right, we got a bit of luck with the goal, but um, every time they tried to break, we were two banks of four and then we broke them. So really well played to the lads and you know, a few of the lads coming in because there's been some suspensions and injuries and they've come in and slotted in well. So really good, building something here. Like you say, it was an excellent performance, but in terms of the completeness, we've played some teams where we've completely dominated them in terms of the scoreline, but in terms of the performance itself, do you think this is the best of the season? It's up there, I think. Yeah, I think the Tunbridge at home when we won 4-0, we really did you know, put the gloss on it. And I think, I think um, soon we're going to get a 2 or 3 or 4-0 again because the boys are working so hard. Um, you know, two, I think we had three 2-1s and a 1-0 and then all the draws. So we've really been scrapping for our lives. And now we're just getting up the league a little bit more. I think um, Nick's a couple more places tonight because the game's off and whatnot. Yeah. So the boys can be really proud of their effort so far. So it's been a good, it's been a good um, turn of the year. It's been 10 games unbeaten now, actually. Okay. Uh, what do you think the reason behind that is? Um, I don't know. I think maybe just people just, it's just clicking for some people now. I think, um, prior, you know, we had little patches in certain months and weeks before Christmas where, you know, we were playing well and then we weren't and we were dipping and we was up again. But when you find a bit of consistency, um, obviously we haven't got a big squad either, um, you have to stick together. And as I said, the boys that come in have seemed to slot it in uh, and done really well. And um, and we look dangerous. We look dangerous, um, especially on the counter attack. Teams are trying to break us down. You know, look at Saturday. We had ten men. You wouldn't even know we had ten men, and it made it so hard for them. Um, all right, we're hanging on a little bit at the end, but um, yeah, the boys take take all the credit, and it's obviously a great win and a great clean sheet. So, speaking of the clean sheet, you had to pull off a very good save just after our goal. Uh, and a couple of saves here and there as well throughout the game. Uh, not your busiest night, No. but how do you think you did personally? No, I think it's just one of those, um, I think they, we scored and then they just, I think it was their only real attempt and you just got to be, it's just one of those where you just got to be on your, on, your, on your toes and I just reacted and luckily it went over. But um, but they didn't, They didn't. Get, the boys didn't let them get through all night. I was, yeah, it wasn't busy at all. Um, I think that was actually the only save to be fair. So. Um, boys in front, Sean and, and Claudia have been solid and then you've got Alfie coming in and, and T at left back and I said to them both tonight, you know, keep it simple, do your jobs and it makes it difficult for people and then you've got a nice little pair, uh, three of them in the middle, Spencer, uh, TJ and Arm at the moment and then people are confident with them keeping the ball so that allows Wellesley and then Reese and, and Laney to, to break and feel confident to push on a bit more, we sent it in the changing room so it's, it's really good times at the moment so let's just see what we can do. Finally, you were talking about momentum earlier on and uh, potentially a big win. Is there any better place than Hendon away on Saturday? <laughs> well, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I don't think I've ever played there, so are you going to walk straight through or are you going to go around? <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> uh, we'll see. I mean, I don't know if it's like a derby or whatever for this, for Wingate, if it's, if it's a big game, but we'll just take it as it comes, you know, standard stuff. No, no one, nothing to fear at the moment. You know, least them are meant to be. I think they've lost three or four games all year, and we put them. Well, they were fourth before today. So, so you know, we've shown we can mix it with the best of them. So let's let's see what happens Saturday. But we should be very confident after tonight and Saturday's win. Brilliant, thank you. No worries. We're here with fullback Tanashi Abrahams. That was a fantastic one of victory over this. And how do you think the boys performed tonight? I thought we did very well against a team that's fourth in the league, and we've scored a lot of goals. So. I'm happy to get the three points. Um, that's ten games in a row now. We haven't lost, so I'm happy. Um, in terms of the style we played tonight, there's a lot of high pressing going on. Do you think that contributed to the win? Yeah, because if we make mistakes, we just have to press them high, then we'll get it back quickly. So we're happy with that, yeah. And individually for you, you've got a run of games in the side. Do you think <laughs> that's helped your confidence going forward? Yeah, it has massively. It's good to get games, good to get minutes under, under your belt. And I'm happy with that. And I just want to push on to Saturday now. Be good. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that game. It's yeah, obviously it's... a big one. Derby at Hendon. How do you think that's going to go? Um, we, we just have to try our best and try to get number 11, so let's do it. Right, cheers to Thank you. you.